find ABC 22's Taylor Viles for a big game on Tournament Thursday at Virtue Field. Hi, Taylor. Well, Lauren, it is Tournament Thursday here at Virtue Field, the Vermont men's soccer team, just an hour away from hosting Quinnipiac for the round one of the Division I NCAA Tournament. You might be asking yourselves, why is Vermont here, considering they were eliminated from playoff contention in the America East play just last week in the semifinal game. But coming up in just about 20 minutes, I'll tell you why they are here and what's in store for the game where they try to continue their season. Well, I know I said it was do or die for the Vermont men's soccer team when they faced U Albany a week ago at Virtue Field in the semifinal game of their America East playoffs, and that wasn't totally false. The Cats lost that game, and that loss knocked them out of the playoffs, but tonight we're back at Virtue Field. It's round one of the NCAA tournament, and Vermont is playing. It was an at-large bid that allowed Vermont to be here today. Basically, the NCAA tournament committee decided that because the Cats were nationally ranked for much of the year, they deserve a shot to prove themselves against the best teams in the country. So here we are, and Vermont's opponent, that would be Quinnipiac, a school that Vermont hasn't seen much of historically. But this year, when the Bobcats came to Virtue Field at the end of August, they gave the Catamounts what would be their first loss of just two home losses all year long. But that was a long time ago, and since then, Vermont has strung together a mid-season 11-game win streak, reached number eight on the national rankings, and beat future America East champion New Hampshire. Yesterday, Catamount Alex Nagy discussed his team's readiness for the big game. The pregame session today was, was flying, so it was, it was good to see that. And we're just, we're just looking to carry that energy into the game tomorrow, put, put a few past Quinnipiac. This is exactly the spot where we wanted to be since day one, and now we're here, so we, we really just want to take advantage of the opportunity. Well, it's a cold night at Virtue Field, currently about 30 degrees with wind chill, but that's not stopping the people from coming out. I spoke with UVM's Director of Athletics, Jeff Schulman, about the attendance expectations for the game. I think it's still available uh, at uh, at Virtue Field. Uh, I certainly want to encourage fans to to get out. It's going to be a great game. It's a it's a little chilly tonight, but that never stopped uh, Vermonters. So uh, bundle up, and uh, it's going to be dry, and you'll see some fantastic national caliber collegiate soccer. So this is truly a must-win game. A loss would mean the end of the season and the end of the college careers of at least 10 members of Vermont, most notably midfield staple Alex Nagy and two-time America East goalie of the year Nate Silvera. If you can't make it to the game, it's available for stream on ESPN+. Kickoff is coming up right here at 7 p.m. Going to be a very exciting game here. And I will have the highlights later on for you tonight, of course. But for now, for sports, I'm Taylor Viles. We'll be right back.